Sri Lankan people returned to protest. The Dutch farmers also returned to streets. The Serbian farmers are heading to the capital city to show their traffic action ever. This is a very difficult time for farmers all over the world. And as a consequence of no farmers, no food, we will be next. This is what happening in the last few days. Serbian farmers have been protesting for a week now. And the Serbian government threatens retaliation if they continue. The Serbian farmers' answer is simple. We will come to their grave. And it will be a very hot autumn in Europe and beyond. Before that, the German farmers surrounded the Ministry of Agriculture. And today, a massive crowd of German people shouted at their chancellor, Liar! Traitor! Go away! The Dutch farmers continue revolting in many places. On August 18th, farmers in Cedar took the streets in a huge number to make their voice heard. Indian farmers, after blocking the road to Delhi, continue protesting in countryside in a massive number. In Australia, Victorian people have had enough. They demand no more radical globalist policy. They want job and freedom. Argentinian citizens protested outside the presidential palace over high inflation rates. Millions of Argentinian people were also protesting all over the country. Sri Lankan people demonstrated again on August 18th. They don't want a newly appointed president who's so close to the World Economic Forum. According to a recent survey, the globalist policy caused more than two-thirds of Sri Lankan families struggling to feed themselves. Due to price hikes, a lack of fuel and food shortages have left families struggling to feed their children.